Let's talk about St. Louis because I think that there is a lot to like here. Starting off with their quarterback, Jordan Ta'amu. And you can like him because he's efficient, which he is. His adjusted yards per attempt is 8.1, second best in the XFL behind Josh Johnson. But you can also like him because he runs a lot. He has run 36 times for 186 yards. No other quarterback in the XFL has run more than 17 times. So he is almost doubling the field. Math. He is doubling the field. No. Yeah, he is. Okay, yeah, yeah. He's, he's doubling the field. Cool. Math. Awesome. The defenders are third in coverage grade at Pro Football Focus, so they're a good defense, but... I still think Tom is, I would argue he's undervalued at $20. Is that outrageous, or what do you think in here with Tom? I mean, I don't think there's any price high enough for him. Uh, he's my quarterback. Uh, but, I mean. <laughs> it's my quarterback. <laughs> but, like, seriously, I mean, the, the rushing yards have been somewhat consistent, uh, 77, 32, 14, 63. So he's given you some some production each game. Uh, he's cleared 200 passing yards and 20 fando points in three of the four games as well. I mean, this team is just really good. Uh, they have one loss, and it was to Houston by four points. And we obviously talked about how good a team Houston is. So uh, this is, like, a really, really good team. Uh, they almost are undefeated with, like, a really uh, big win over Houston. So, uh, And a lot of it has to do with just Tomu being so efficient on yeah. the ground through the air. And I think that $20 is probably too low. Uh, I don't know where he'd be. I don't think I'd quite put him on, on like, the $23 level as, as Walker, but... 22, at least 21. I feel like he should be more expensive than Josh Johnson, though. I would say he's in the same tier as Walker, which means he should be more expensive than 20 bucks. If we're talking about, like, the full four-game slate, I would say that Tamu is 1A, 1B with P.J. Walker as the number one quarterback, and I think that he is definitively the number, my number one quarterback for the Sunday-only slate. But even when you add in P.J. Walker, I would say Tamu deserves to be at or near the top of the list because he's just he's really good he runs a lot and that's what we want for fantasy